LA's homeless crisis is getting worse. The newly released homeless count shows more people are on the streets despite massive amounts of money and programs to help. This year's count shows homelessness rose 9% in the county and jumped 10% in the city. There are more than 75,000 unhoused people in the county and more than 46,000 in the city. So why aren't we seeing any progress? Well, joining us now with a closer look at the problem is Dr. Valicia adams Kellum, CEO of the Los Angeles Homeless Services Authority. Hello and welcome. Hello, thanks for having me. Absolutely. Dr. Kellum, you know, the rise in numbers had to be a bit of a blow. Were you expecting the rise? Well, I will tell you, it's very disappointing, but not surprising. We see that there is an increasing number of folks who are vulnerable economically and disadvantaged in a number of ways. And so despite our tremendous efforts, we're finding people falling into homelessness faster than we can get them out. Well, Lhasa obviously doing a lot of work with Mayor Karen Bass and the efforts to clear the streets and get services and housing. So what does these increased numbers really mean for those efforts? Is it just too soon to see the effects of your work? Well, it's a good question. We are so happy to have a mayor who is dedicated to fighting homelessness and a board of supervisors who are in lockstep and locked arms literally in this regard. But it's absolutely the case that we do the point in time count in January and that did actually happen before the bulk of these efforts launched. So there's still much to be hopeful for. We really have to stay focused on a concerted, strategic, coordinated effort to address street homelessness. And I believe that we can get there if we're all on the same page. But do you think that some of the people on our streets actually choose to be there and no matter what you do, it won't make a big enough difference? Oh, what we found in the mayor's Inside Safe program and many other endeavors is that people do not want to remain on the streets. For the most part, when we're out there engaging people in encampments and we are offering housing with services, they say yes. So we just have to stay focused on reducing this humanitarian crisis, offer resources and housing that people want, and I believe we can address this crisis. All right, Dr. Cullen, thank you so much for your time this morning. Thank you so much.